Immobile may win the Golden Boot Award. Salah gave a hint on leaving Liverpool. Messi wants to see a legendary coach in Barcelona. EPL season ended and Juventus is the champion of Serie A. Another day, another news. Subscribe and you won't miss anything. Buddy, who do you think is the coolest captain among team's leaders? Write your variant in the comments below. Now press like and let's get started. Immobile caught up Lewandowski in the race for the Golden Boot Award, scoring a hat-trick in the game versus Verona. Both strikers have 34 goals each. Officially, MU and Chelsea will play in 2020-21 season of the Champions League. Arsenal placed on 8th position on EPL, that's the worst club result for 25 years. Man City scored 100-plus goals per season 5 times and set a record of England. Vardy became the best EPL striker for the first time in his 33 years. He's better than Aubameyang and Danny Ings on one goal. De Bruyne assisted 20 times in EPL, repeating Henri's 2002-2003 season record. Manchester United kicked 14 penalty this season. That's the record of EPL. Ronaldo scored 10 goals after season's restart. It is the biggest number among everyone in top 5 European leagues. Zlatan asks for 6 million euros a year. Milan offers 4. The negotiations about a new contract for Ibrahimovic are ongoing. If Pogba leaves, MU will try to buy Grealish and Sancho. Barcelona is the possible winner of this Champions League. We are the possible winners of every tournament, announced Josep Bartomeu, the president of Barcelona. Photos of the new Milan home kit appeared. A pattern on the stripes was inspired by the cathedral in Milan. Chelsea offers Getafe 30 million euros for Barca's graduate Cucurea. The game between Man City and Real will take place, despite a 14-day quarantine for those who enter Spain. Guardiola will allow Manchester City players to choose their own captain after Silva leaves. Sergio Ramos invited Conor McGregor on Real's training. Conor agreed. Liverpool is interested in Quebec. Schalke may sell defender for 35 million euros. Fouls made by David Luiz brought to the penalty kick in Arsenal's net five times. That's EPL anti-record of the season. 99 points of Liverpool is the second best result in EPL history. Man City got 100 points two years ago. Addison is the best in EPL in dry matches. He has 16. Alisson and De Gea shared the third place. Everton's defender Leighton Baines announced about the end of his career as a footballer. Adama Traore successfully passed for 183 times in this EPL season. That's the new EPL record. Immobile scored 14th goal for the penalty. That's Serie A's record. Ronaldo has two goals less. Real shirt presses and Hazard failed. Next season will be better, announced Fabio Capello. Lionel Messi wants to see Marcelo Bielsa as the new coach of Barcelona. After the game against Wolverhampton, Pedro announced that he leaves the club from London. Good luck in your new club! Yesterday, the last EPL Tour took place and in Serie A, a champion has been finally decided. All the results are on your screens. And now to the main news. Mohamed Salah answered the question about his further career. No one knows what's going to happen in future. We'll see. Right now, after we won the Champions League and EPL, I'm very happy. Let's see what's going to happen next. Klopp, since he came into a team, players' mentality changed and we became winners, announced the Egyptian in an interview to LAFM Colombia. Manchester City and Liverpool ended championship with decent wins on Norwich and Newcastle. But the main question was different. In the 38th EPL game week, Manchester United met Leicester and Chelsea hosted Wolverhampton. Before the tour start, Chelsea and Leicester were contenders on the Champions League zone. Leicester were losing one point to them. All in all, the destiny of the place in the zone was decided in a game between MU and Leicester. Stulcher's team beat their opponent with a score of 2-0, thanks to the penalty kick on 71st minute that was scored by Fernandes. Lingard's goal was scored an 8th extra minute and didn't decide anything. The Red Devils stand in the third place in the table and are back in the Champions League. Our congratulations! Chelsea stands in the fourth place, beating Wolverhampton with a score of 2-0. 
Mount and Giroud scored. Now the table looks like this. Leicester, Tottenham and Arsenal or Wolverhampton will play in Europa League. If the Gunners will beat Chelsea in FA Cup Finals, they again will play in Europa League. Norwich, Watford and Bournemouth are out from the Premier League. Well, it is time to congratulate Juventus. The club from Turin became the champion of Italy. It was expected. Juventus outplayed Sampdoria with a score of 2-0. Cristiano Ronaldo made the game for Maurizio Sarri's team. First, Portuguese scored from a beautiful free-kick play made by Pjanic, and then after Ronaldo's kick and Aldero's save, Bernadeschi scored. Ronaldo had one more chance to light his surname up on the table, but Portuguese didn't score a penalty kick for the first time this season. Juventus leader finished this season with 31 goals scored. Next, we are going to talk about records and interesting facts. Juventus became an Italian championship for ninth time in a row, that's top league's record. They became an Italian champion for 36th time, Milan and Inter has 18. Mauricio Sarri won his second trophy in Korea and first championship. Our congratulations! Cristiano Ronaldo won 31st trophy in his career and third with Juventus. Buffon won Serie A for 10th time. That's the league's record. Turin celebrated with joy. Juan Cuadrado poured over team's head. Guys, thanks for watching and watch suggested videos if you missed previous episodes. It was Football News Channel. Good help to you all. Bye-bye.